talking about cooler temperatures all day and we know that the holidays are right around the corner. A lot of you may be hosting some parties coming up. So we have Chef Sam Dimonich, the owner of your farms, your table restaurant group and restaurant Constance in the kitchen with us. This Good morning. morning. Thanks for being here. Good. Thanks for having me. So with the holidays coming up, it can be kind of stressful for people, right? Yeah, if yeah, yeah. Trying to figure out what they're going to serve people. So sure. explain how you can help. Sure. Yeah. Well, I mean, we, look, we'll, we'll take the uh, the cooking off your hands, so to speak. Okay. Um, no, we've been doing this for a couple of years now. We love to come in people's homes and provide them an in-home experience. We'll bring the restaurant to your to your house, uh, to your backyard, to your front porch, to your back porch, whatever the case may be. Awesome. And people can kind of decide what kind of food they want. What, yeah. all, what all do you offer? Yeah, well, like we're going to do um, some hors d'oeuvres today that are kind of um, attached to the four horse menu or the appetizer menu. OK. Yeah, but um, but so we started this pandemic and, and the first course out of the four courses would be kind of like the shared appetizer experience. Because mm -hmm. remember, during the pandemic, everybody forgot to how to talk to each other. Right, <laughs> right, right. So this was like one of those cool like conversation starters, ideally, you know, okay. to get everybody together and, and and to mix it up a little bit. Nice. Well, let's get into it. What are we making? Let's do it. So we have um, so we have a couple of orders uh, that are pre prepared. So we have labna. This is a labna toast with citrus, fennel and um, we have dates Yum. and then we have ahi tuna tacos. And then mm -hmm. over here, you guys are going to see some pork belly bao buns. Yum. Yeah, so all three of these are, you know, kind of on the favorites list and, um, you know, kind of offer, uh, you know, from a spectrum standpoint, a little bit of everything. Sure. And, um, you know, we have fun. We source locally and, um, you know, and there's cool spectrum of flavors involved in these plates. Okay. Yeah, so we have a little bit of our Korean barbecue. Yum, okay. Delicious. I wish you guys could be here smelling how good this smells. <laughs> My green screen is like right there. So I've been, I've been smelling this for the last All morning long you've been waiting hour. for this. I know. Amazing. Eric kept saying I can't wait till 820. Yeah, so a little bit about uh, the ingredients. So we, we source uh, intentionally, we source as locally as possible. This pork belly is from Mooresville. Okay. And um, and much of what you see right here, uh, you know, is, is sourced within about a 30 mile radius. How awesome. Right? Yeah, so this it's a cool way to operate, I think, and it's a cool way to tell the stories of the true heroes in my eyes in the culinary community, and those are the farmers and suppliers. Absolutely. You know, people that we're super proud of and we love to uh, kind of partner with. Yeah, and it kind of gives people a story, too, if they're hosting, uh, you know, people to kind of explain where this food's coming from. That was the conversation starter. Yeah, I mean, like, that was the whole intention behind starting the business when I did in the pandemic is, like, just to make sure that the, you know, like, the underdog farmer, you know, the mom and pop, the super grassroots movement that are yeah. here in Charlotte and right. they're really everywhere, but here in Charlotte, have a voice. Absolutely. You know, and, um, you know, and, and of course, me being an ingredient based chef, uh, it makes my life a lot easier absolutely. to be able to absolutely. source it. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah you know, can and, we try and, this? And, oh, absolutely. Okay, absolutely. Eric, try I'm one of those bao buns. Yeah, I'm going to. Eric's going straight for the bao bun. Okay, what is this? So that is, um, that is labna. That is yogurt. Mm. Yeah, citrus, shermula, a little okay. bit of fennel, and dates. Should I try it? Go for it. Oh my goodness. Mm. We doing okay? Delicious, delicious. Yes, absolutely. Okay, so Are you ready to book an event? I am. Let's I was go gonna right say, now. so let's do it. And yeah. how far in advance should people book with, with you We need guys? about a week. About a about week? About a week, two oh, weeks. Okay. Ideally we have a couple months. Okay, you know? okay. So the sooner the better, if you're, if you're better. already looking ahead to Thanksgiving or Christmas. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah. But like, you know, there's only a handful of Fridays and Saturdays during December, right? Mm -hmm. Right. Yep, and, and those fill up the quickest, so yeah. Okay, and Jump so people online. can go to your website. Um, I think we have your information that we can pull up to let people know how they can get in contact with you. Um, but thank you so much for being here. I'm Thanks sure for having people, me, man. I'm sure you book up fast. This is, this is great. We're okay, good? I'm yeah. going to eat one of those in the commercial break. Yeah.